Cut and run is an enzyme-based approach used to identify genomic locations of transcription factors or histone modifications. This technique was developed in the laboratory of Dr. Stephen Hennikoff and is first described in the publications listed here. The procedure begins with magnetic bead-based isolation of cells. This allows for easy handling of low cell numbers throughout the experiment. Next, a mild detergent called digitonin is used to permeabilize intact cells and introduce an antibody that targets a protein of interest. After antibody binding, micrococcal nuclease tagged with either protein A or protein A and protein G is introduced into the cells. The protein A or protein AG tag binds the antibody introduced in the previous step. This allows recruitment of the micrococcal nuclease enzyme specifically to the protein target of interest. Once the micrococcal nuclease has been recruited to the protein of interest, the reaction is cooled to zero degrees Celsius, and calcium is introduced to activate enzymatic activity. The activated nuclease will then cleave DNA proximal to the protein of interest. This results in the production of small DNA fragments that correspond to regions of genomic occupancy by the protein of interest. Next, a stop buffer is introduced to chelate calcium in order to stop the enzymatic reaction. This stop buffer can also contain spike in DNA that is used for calibration at the analysis stage. The reaction is then heated to 37 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes to allow for release of small DNA fragments from the permeabilized but still intact cells. The cells are then pelleted by centrifugation and the supernatant containing DNA fragments is isolated and subjected to phenol chloroform extraction to isolate DNA from any bound proteins. The isolated DNA is then subjected to library preparation followed by sequencing. 